What's up? This is Charles Dubcheck, developer of Worldsmith, and today we're going to test some explosives. I'm here in this pretty secure bunker. We're gonna just step outside and let's see. Lots of chickens. Now this is a peculiar dimension. Okay, well we have some conventional explosives here. Let's try these out. Now this is the dimension that has lowered gravity. So you can jump super high. Let's see how this explosive does. Eh, that kind of sucked. That's nothing. Let's test out something a little more potent. Condensed explosive. Let's try one of these. See if we can uh, do some damage to this terrain. Alright, let's get a little bit of this. Whoa, that detonated fast. Uh, there's a Someone's attacking me. Whew. Okay, got him. That was alright. I mean, that was better than before. I mean, look at that big crater. Uh, let's, let's get inside. It's nighttime. Monsters are coming out. Even though there are monsters out here, anyways. Let's see. Oh, that is a lot of bad guys. Let's see. When we tried condensed explosives. Breaching incendiary. Let's try an incendiary explosive. See if we can uh, get some of these monsters with it. Just set this off. We got two. Shit. Let's, let's get out of here. This guy follows me. Oh look, he set something on fire. Didn't really do any damage to this building, but that's because it's made of concrete. And reinforced concrete. It's a pretty secure bunker. Let's, uh, let's go to where we can find some natural terrain to actually try out some of these. I'm recording this video not to fight monsters, but to show, to demonstrate you, to y'all what I've been working on here. Alright. Now let's, uh... Kill this guy. It's passive. Okay. Wow! This concrete's taken forever to mine. I'm not dealing with this. Let's breach right through. Alright. Get away from this. Oh, I guess I placed two without realizing it. You can place them behind blocks to kind of conceal them, make some traps. Alright. Okay, there we go. Killed that guy. Ow. Oh. oh well. Okay, thank goodness for the low gravity. Alright, so we've done incendiary breaching. Well, let's let's do a thermobaric. Let's get away from this thing. Did some damage. Thermobaric, nuclear, thermonuclear, antimatter. Let, let's try a cryogenic. We'll, we'll get to some of the big ones in a bit. We've got time. Let's do a. Oh crap, I'm on such low health. Alright, let's place one of these. There we go. Cryogenic. Yep, that one was good. Oh, and I placed two of those. Love to see it. Alright, so we've got endothermic and exothermic. These ones are gonna blow bigger. Let's do an exothermic. Maybe get some of these monsters.
Alright, let's get the heck out of here. Oh, let's go. Wow, that was huge. I bet you the endothermic is going to be similar. I mean, I say this, I, I created this. <laughs> so I know it's going to. So let's, let's go and uh, detonate one of these. Do it by this guy. This rude dude. Get away from me. Left some snow. Two blasts. Okay. Well, you know what? I'm done playing around. And quite frankly, I'm not very fond of this dimension. So let's uh, teach it a lesson. We're going nuclear. Oh, wow. I'm almost dead. All right. That, yeah, that's how I feel about this place. Now we gotta get the heck out of here because this could actually kill me. Especially since I'm at 5 health. Uh oh. Out of time. Wow, and I died. Before it even went off. Okay, that's a little lame. Let's, uh, let's go to a dimension. Typical. All right. Well, we've loaded this dimension up. Also, low gravity. Is this mummy hostile? No, this this mummy is not hostile. Okay, let's blow this place up. Let's go. Ooh, it's night time. Waiting for the explosion. Is this guy gonna get me? Oh, there we go. There we go. And I just missed the blast radius. Sweet. Whoa. Yep, this one went big. This is a huge crater. Lots of fallout, too. It was a dirty bomb. Your monster is dying due to the radiation. But this isn't enough. We're, we're gonna do something even bigger. Once I get out of this crater. Uh, and I'm poisoned. Okay. Yeah, so this is another dimension with very low gravity. Great for testing stuff, honestly. Some dimensions of gravity so strong they struggle even go up a block or two. And that's part of the challenge. Oh, here we go. Here's a bunker. Well, this bunker ain't gonna stand a chance against this next explosive. That's right. Put the nuclear away. We're gonna go thermonuclear. Let's put that right here. Oh, let's go. I do not want to stick around for this one. Uh-oh. I might have ran out of time. Let's hope this is hard enough. Ooh. Let's set off some other explosives from within the building. Yep, ooh, this is huge. Wow. And we, we didn't even put that one near the ground. 
Wow. Yep. Oh, we we're destroying. And over here is probably where those other explosives went off. All this water falling because of this explosion. Okay. Well, there's one more left to test. That's the antimatter. I want to go somewhere where there's no crater, but I'm kind of locked in here. Let's go. Sweet. The game freezes when chunks are loading. It's no big deal. It just means chunks are loading. My computer kind of sucks, anyways. I know, ironic for the developer. Oh, look, an enchanted forest biome. Yep, we're blowing this up. Place that one behind this block. Alright, well we detonated it. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Uh oh. Please tell me I've made I've made it far enough. Yep, this one was deadly. Ooh. All these liquids falling down. Wow. We're not even near the center. We went all the way back to the building. Yep, here we go. Wow. So we've got some pretty powerful explosives in this game. I'm just going to equip my armor once again and uh, get back to surviving in these dimensions. Thank you very much for your time watching this demonstration and I look forward to continuing work on this game. Goodbye.